Superman of science And he loves to play with fire And the things you do You can do If you so desire Do try this at home with Mr. G Hello and welcome back to Do Try This at Home This is the show that takes ordinary household items and turns them into something extraordinary. I'm your host, Mr. G, and well, we've got a visitor with us today. What brings you by, Scully? Oh, I see. Yeah, you're right. Halloween's getting real close. It's almost October. It's getting dark early outside. Leaves are falling down from the trees, and the wind is whipping the day like crazy. And so, I'm in the house here for a little bit. I'll be outside later, probably to pick up sticks and leaves that have blown down from all my trees. But for, before we start with any of the hard work outside, I wanted to show you some magic tricks. Not just one magic trick, not even two, but three magic tricks. That's right, three for the price of one today. Let's get started. Well, what are you going to need first of all? You're going to need a balloon. You're going to need the arch enemy of the balloon, which is a straight pin, a rubber band, and an ordinary pen. Let's start by pulling in a little bit closer and I'll show you something that you can do with just an ordinary pen that will just blow the minds of people around you. Wow, did you hear that black cat? Uh-oh, things are getting kind of spooky. Okay, here we have just an ordinary pen, as you can see. It's nothing special. I'm going to set that pen here on the table and then, simply through mind over matter, I'm going to cause this pen to move. Now you can say, well, you can bang the table and the pen kind of moves. From the bottom, maybe? Let's try. Yeah, I can get that pen to sort of move, but watch this. I'm going to move it with the power of my mind and the magnetic forces in my own hand. Here we go. You'll be able, by the end of today's show, you'll also know how to do this trick. Okay, let's get started here. Amazing. Let's try it again. This time I'm going to make it go even better with just two fingers. Amazing! Let's move on to the second trick. For this trick, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to take a rubber band. You're going to, need to place it on your fingers, the first two fingers of your hand, like this. See how I've done that? Now, the next part of the trick, you're going to take where that rubber band is on your fingers here, and you're going to make a fist like I've done. You can see that that rubber band is going only around those two first fingers. Now, simply by opening your hand, the rubber band magically moves from those two fingers onto those two fingers. Okay, let's move on to our last trick. This is an incredible magic trick that's just amazing. You need an ordinary balloon, and you're going to need a straight pin like you see here. Blow up your balloon. Now, once you've got your balloon completely blown up like I've got mine here, take your pin and watch this. I'm going to move in a little closer for you here. Now watch this. How many of you think that I'm going to be able to take this pin and pierce this balloon with it? Watch. Here we go. Whoa! The balloon did not break and the pin is in the balloon, or it was. Let's do it again. Oh, I can hear it leaking air around the pin. The balloon does not burst. Now, if I say the magic words, balloon burst, the balloon bursts when I touch it with the pin. Amazing! Okay, earlier in the video I told you that I'd let you know how these magic tricks were done at the end of the video. Well, guess what? It's the end of the video and I've decided to wait. I've decided to wait until the next episode of Do Try This at Home where I'll reveal how each trick was performed. And in the meantime, it'll make it a lot more fun. It'll give you a chance to comment as to how you think each trick was done. So remember to comment and, of course, rate and subscribe. I'm Mr. G. See you next time on Do Try This at Home.
And now watch, when I open up my hand, as if it were magic, the rubber band moves from these two fingers right through my flesh to the other two fingers. Again, I'll show you how this trick's done at the end of today's video. And I've got the wrong stinking shirt on. Hello and welcome back to Do Try This at Home. Do Try This at Home is the show that takes ordinary household items like this pen and I burped and these are in the wrong place. Oh boy, I started. What's that? It's getting close to Halloween. It is getting close to Halloween, which is exactly why I am going to do some... Okay, now let's talk a little bit about how those tricks were done. First we'll have an earthquake because the cat's brushing against... Oh, cat, please don't do that again. Why do you have to use that as a scratching post?